Hello, I'm Dr. Garrett Castleberry, an Associate Professor and Program Director of Communication, Media, and Ethics at Mid-America Christian University. I'd like to welcome you all to COM 5103, Advanced Professional Communication and Leadership Practicum. And um, that's a mouthful right off the bat, the title of the course, and I'm going to unpack the rationale for that and establish a few expectations for what this course is about, where we're going, and how it's going to mobilize your professional development as you pursue uh, your graduate degree of choice. And so let's get started. Let's talk about it. Well, if you've either been a communication major, some of you, or a business major in your background, many of you, or maybe many other uh, related degrees, digital marketing comes to mind and uh, healthcare management might be an option. There are so many, really. Uh, but if you followed any of these tracks, it's likely you've encountered a professional communication type course. And these are often related to uh, organizational communication as a subdiscipline, or com for short. Um, but this course is designed to help us not look at organizational structures and patterns, which we assume most of you have had that uh that exposure to in the past, if not firsthand through your own professional experiences, but uh, also through curriculum um, as, as it is. But we are approaching this content idea from a communication perspective. And so that, uh, that means we're going to uh, look at ways to accentuate our role uh, as potential leaders, regardless of our position in the organization. And so um, given the graduate status of this course as a 5,000 level class, we're considering it an advanced uh, entry into professional communication. And then when we look at that second phrase in the title, leadership practicum, we're talking about gaining experience or enhancing the experiences we're already a part of in an organizational setting. Um, and so you don't have to be a part of the corporate world. You may not even have to, quote, um, be actively working presently to gain a strong foothold and find immediate value. And so that's what we call use value for what we're going to be talking about and doing in this course together, all right? And so this is when we're talking about applied learning, uh, a part of, uh, at least for communication discipline, part of the uh, uh, movement that we refer to as applied humanities, um, practicum is that essential term. And we are going to, uh, we are going to be practicing professional communication skills in this course. And so that's something you can look forward to. You can choose to be excited about it. You can organically be excited about it. Um, but our encouragement is that if you approach it with a healthy mindset, you're going to not only have um, a much easier pathway to success through the course, you might even enjoy it. All right. And so one of the things that's it's important to recognize is we all have that innate understanding that we need to be better communicators. The literature is everywhere. All of those uh, enormous business reports come out and one of the top items, uh, employers uh, at a corporate level, um, but really all over re report back in surveys is they wish employees had stronger communication skills. It's a top three filing, sometimes the top filing among organizations. And so this course meets that immediate need. We want to help strengthen your communication skills here now in this course weekly. And we've got a number of readings and assignments and, and breakout opportunities for you to get better. All right. And so that's a look into the course identity. And I'm, I'm uh, explaining this in a broad sense, then we will utilize future videos or, or even conversations if if your class is meeting in person or or in a synchronized manner online, uh, we are going to explore the minutia of the class incrementally as it comes to us. But this is simply an overview of of how we can understand the course title and recognize it has uh, immediate identity to what we'll be doing, and uh, that's an expectation we can share and embrace 
because if it's something we know we should get better at, um, typically the only uh, hindrance between knowing and doing is what? It's accountability. And here we have this six week accountability space to grow together. And so that's my encouragement to you is that we are going to go along this journey together. We're gonna to work toward your betterment. Um, these, there's going to be elements of personal improvement and that will come in the form of knowledge, but it will also come in the form of engagement, but especially in the form of personal direct application. Uh, that leadership practicum to help you grow individually so that you can better service others uh, as well as yourself, um, both personally and, uh, and corporately.